Hey everybody, this is James from Sonic Alchemy Makerspace. What do we got here? That's right. It's a Hero 101. Oh my goodness. A Hero 101. A 3D printer even. So, let's talk about why this is here and what we're going to do with it. Let's get started. That's right. So, the new project... And that's why we didn't have a video last week as we were setting this up is an experiment with what we can do and uh, what we can make and how we're going to change this here hero 101 so if you don't know what the hero 101 is it is a kickstarter project that was created to create a 49 euro dollar 3d printer and so they did it they got their money they fulfilled it they started shipping problem is if you can see that to make it a 49 euro printer they had to cut cost so things like the stepper driver motors are this sort of thing so this is a cheap one euro stepper motor it's not even a true stepper motor. If you want to make it a, a, a stepper motor like you would find the, the, the NEMA 17s, you actually have to pop this open and cut one of the lines. So, uh, and the extruder itself is basically the same as what you might find in a 3D pen. And the board is all cheaper proprietary stuff so question is what can we print with this what can we do to improve it so already there's a couple things in the works but as you can see it's got these here which have been 3d printed 3d printed these are kind of like uh, the idea of a rep wrap or a rep strap so the idea is to take a 3d printer and print parts to improve it these here to improve structural integrity. These here for the uh, the vertical. This is what's also this is what's known as a delta. So you have three vertical axes, and then these arms, tensioner arms, which come down, and the print the hot end itself sits in the middle there. So it's already been tweaked. It's got rubber bands and some tensioners there. It's got tensioners that have been 3D printed here and here. And this would be where the um, filament goes. So that's what's going on. That's what's the new project. So if you're interested in seeing what I'm going to do with this, make sure you subscribe down below. Or leave a comment if you have a suggestion on something we can do, we can try out. Um, the plans so far are looking at replacing the hot end uh, with a, an E3 V6 hot end with the Volcano uh, aluminum, the Chinese kit that you can get. Um, probably either 3D printing an extruder and trying that out and on the other side maybe trying out one of those aluminum cast iron or aluminum ones that you can get from China the clone of the Titan try that out and see how that goes one of the big questions is how fast can you get that to go so plus the build platform is 10 centimeters by 10 centimeters by 10, so 10 centimeters cubed. So what can we do with it? And uh, if you have any suggestions or anything you want to see us try, let me know. Finally, we're going to be doing and working on a couple of projects that have been on hold. So the first one is continuing with the BB-8 build. There's some really, the quality is not so great, but there are some, I'll put some links down below of videos I shot on the old version of the BB-8 I was building, as well as a couple of costume cosplay 
and some electronics projects which will include now 3D printing. So if you like that, please like down below, little button, and subscribe to stay informed. Thanks guys, keep making.